More than four decades ago, a spacecraft the size of a small car left Earth, carrying with it humanity's hopes of reaching the farthest corners of the solar system. Its mission was ambitious, almost unbelievable at the time. It would explore the outer planets, collect scientific data, and if all went well, one day push beyond the very boundary that defines our solar neighborhood. That spacecraft is Voyager 1. And remarkably, after all these years, it's still traveling, still sending us signals from places no human-made object has ever reached. Voyager 1 has journeyed farther than any other spacecraft in history. It has traveled billions upon billions of kilometers through the cold, dark vacuum of space, passing through regions that were, until its arrival, completely unexplored. And now, it's once again defying expectations. Recently, Voyager 1 has transmitted new data from the very edge of our solar system, an area called the Heliopause. What it's found there has astonished scientists and sparked a wave of curiosity across the scientific community. To understand why this is so extraordinary, we have to go back to the beginning. Voyager 1 was launched in 1977 with a clear set of objectives. To study the gas giants, Jupiter and Saturn, up close, to examine their moons and magnetic fields, and to beam back data that would expand our understanding of the solar system. It succeeded brilliantly, sending home stunning images and measurements that reshaped planetary science. After its planetary tour, Voyager 1 continued its voyage outward, deeper into the solar system, and eventually beyond it. In 2012, Voyager 1 reached a milestone that no spacecraft had ever achieved. It crossed the heliopause. This is the boundary where the solar wind, a stream of charged particles from the sun, finally weakens and gives way to the winds and radiation of interstellar space. Beyond the heliopause, our sun's influence fades and the environment becomes truly alien. Voyager 1 officially became the first human-made object to enter interstellar space. But even after accomplishing that historic feat, it didn't stop. It kept going. Now, more than 47 years since its launch, Voyager 1 has recorded something at the edge of the heliosphere that scientists are calling an impossible discovery. The heliopause, once thought to be a relatively stable boundary, is not behaving as expected. Recent data from Voyager 1 has revealed strange fluctuations in the magnetic field in this region. These are not random. They appear as low-level vibrations or pulses that repeat, forming patterns. Until now, the magnetic field in this area was believed to be mostly constant, but the signals Voyager 1 is detecting suggest otherwise. This anomaly is puzzling. It hints at the presence of unknown forces or energy types acting just beyond our solar system. Some scientists believe these fluctuations might be a new kind of energy, something we've never recorded before. Others suggest they might be echoes. From far-off cosmic events, waves of force rippling through the galaxy and interacting with our solar system. What's more, these vibrations might not be coming from within the heliosphere at all. They might be responses to something outside it, something pushing in from the vastness of interstellar space. Imagine that. The edge of our solar system is not a passive boundary, but a dynamic, responsive frontier. Some researchers theorize that these magnetic changes are the result of external influences, perhaps from nearby stars, powerful galactic winds, or even larger-scale structures in the universe that we've never encountered before. One fascinating hypothesis is that the heliopause is being squeezed or manipulated by a stream of energy flowing through the Milky Way, possibly originating from stellar activity or even more distant cosmic phenomena. If this idea proves correct, it could completely transform our understanding of how the solar system interacts with the rest of the galaxy. We may be witnessing evidence of a vast network of energy currents, an invisible grid that links stars and planetary systems across immense distances. 
These energy flows might function as cosmic bridges, transmitting energy, and maybe even information, between points in the galaxy. It's a vision that sounds like science fiction, but it's rooted in data collected by a real spacecraft, built by human hands, and launched in an era when space travel was still in its infancy. For the scientists studying this data, these findings are more than intriguing. They're a wake-up call. Voyager 1 might be uncovering a fundamental structure of the universe that we never knew existed. This discovery could be the first hint of a much larger cosmic web, a kind of energy matrix that spans the galaxy and connects celestial objects in ways we are only beginning to grasp. It suggests that our solar system, far from being an isolated bubble, is part of a larger and more complex environment shaped by galactic forces. And yet, the tool revealing all of this is a spacecraft built with 1970s technology. Its instruments are primitive by today's standards, and yet they continue to function, delivering data of incredible scientific value. Voyager 1 may be old, but it's still our best and only witness to the conditions at the outer edge of the solar system. Despite being over 23 billion kilometers from Earth, it's still communicating with us, still whispering secrets from the farthest reaches of space. Every tiny signal that arrives is precious. Each one adds to our understanding of what lies beyond. The spacecraft's discoveries are not just scientific. They're deeply human. They remind us of our innate desire to explore, to reach beyond what we know, to ask questions that might not have answers yet. And with every bite of data, Voyager 1 inspires a new generation to keep pushing forward. These revelations could also have very practical consequences for the future of space exploration. Some researchers and engineers believe that the strange signals Voyager 1 has detected might prompt the development of new spacecraft designed specifically to travel through interstellar space. These future missions could be better equipped to study the magnetic structures energy streams, and unknown forces that Voyager 1 is only beginning to detect. Among those inspired by these discoveries is Elon Musk, a prominent figure in space. Innovation. He has closely followed Voyager 1's progress and has called this recent data a wake-up call for humanity. For him, it reinforces the need to develop advanced space travel technologies capable of going farther than ever before. While we may not yet have the ships that can take humans across the heliopause, discoveries like these push us to work faster, think bigger, and aim further. Musk, like many in the scientific community, believes that this could mark the start of a new chapter in space exploration. One where we don't just visit planets, we begin reaching into the interstellar medium itself. It may even force us to rethink the very nature of the universe. Could these energy streams and magnetic anomalies be evidence of intelligent phenomena? Could they be signs of life? Or at the very least, proof that the conditions for life exist far beyond what we can currently see or measure? We don't yet have the answers, but what's clear is that we're getting closer. With every bit of data from Voyager 1, we put another piece in the puzzle of the cosmos. And someday, perhaps, those pieces will reveal a picture of the universe in which we're not alone. Voyager 1 has gone where no machine has ever gone before. It has crossed invisible thresholds, explored uncharted realms, and sent back truths that challenge our assumptions about space. Its mission may be nearing its final years, but the questions it raises will echo for generations. We live on a small planet, orbiting a modest star on the outskirts of a galaxy that itself may be just one thread in a much larger cosmic tapestry. And thanks to Voyager 1, we now know that the universe is not quiet. It is alive with forces we are only beginning to understand. What else might be waiting out there? What strange signals and energies will the next generation of explorers find as they follow in Voyager's path? One thing is certain, the spirit of exploration lives on. 
the journey never truly ends. And with Voyager 1 lighting the way, we're reminded that the next great discovery is always just a little farther ahead, waiting for us to reach out and find it.